Good morning, it's a, uh, it's been a really stormy night. We had lots of rain, uh, but it's gonna be a warm one today, oh, hey yeah. mate? Uh, Kevin and Ryan are out here. Um, we could get up to 80 degrees today, but stormy. This guy's looking a little bit better right now. It's kind of blue, so hopefully, mate, we'll get some get some uh, time in before the rain hits yeah. us again. Already sweating. Yeah, it's boiling. We've only just walked from the car, so uh, we're suffering already. So let's see how we get on. We'll let you know if we find anything. Yeah, nice little flat button here. It's down about eight inches. Nice. Anything on it? Uh, it doesn't look like it. Looks just plain to me. But it's really thin, so that one's pretty old. Oh, that's nice, mate. Yeah, shank's gone on the back, but whatever, it's a keeper. Good, and you got a bunch of musket balls? Yeah, got about 10 so far. <laughs> that's awesome. Good! Oh, good find. I like that button. Thanks. That's awesome, mate. Well done. Heavy at the bottom there. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Still down there. Let's take all this out. So it's got it up. Uh. <laughs> you got it? Best find of the year. <laughs> okay, can you date that one? <laughs> I think that's about 1750. <laughs> oh, a freaking sweet find. Yeah. It's about four feet down as well. Awesome, congratulations, mate. Nice. That's one for the collection. Nice. Yeah, nice little bird point. It's uh, got the back end of the stem broken off, or the notch, sorry. So we were just walking back to the car actually. We finished for the day. Didn't find a whole lot. We're probably going to combine this video with another one. But look at that. Yeah. It's a tiny little one. Yeah. And you got the eye for those things. Yeah, I've been lucky lately. The last uh, week or so, you haven't been out without finding one, have you? Yeah, four in the last week. Freaking sweet, man. But we'll, we'll get a photo of that one yep. uh, before we uh, head back in. But I like that one a lot. Good job, bud. Yeah. Tiny. Okay, day two of the hunt. We were out yesterday. Um, got a lot of musket balls between us. Ryan got a really sweet button. Uh, tell us about the, the button. It was a script A uh, Second Artillery Regiment, uh, 1812, actually. Yeah, U.S. Artillery. Um, they would have crossed over here in 1813 when the Americans captured this area after the, um, the British and Canadian uh, moved out of the area after the Battle of Fort Erie. Uh, sorry, Lake Erie. So that was awesome, oh, yeah. awesome find, really good. And that was, uh, we actually, you'll see the video, you've probably already seen the video. Um, that was one of the flat buttons he got yesterday. Thought it was plain, but it wasn't when he cleaned it. That was sweet, man. So, so you always gotta clean them good. Yeah, so we're back out today. Um, we're looking forward to it, the weather's gonna be good. So uh, we'll let you, let you know if we find anything. We're out here. Uh, Ryan and I, uh, we're doing all right, actually. Yeah. We've both got a uh, nice little flat button. We just uh, filmed Ryan digging one, and like 15 feet away, I, I got one exactly the same. Um, so we're covering this area really well. And I've got a nice find. Um, hopefully the focus works. It's hard to see in this sunshine. But what it looks like to us, it's a, a silver thimble, flattened, very early, very crude. You see the uh, the punch marks on there, the decoration. Um, but yeah, that's awesome. Um, so two flat buttons, this thimble. So uh, we're thinking this is a pretty early sight. Uh, both had a couple of musket balls. Uh, Ryan had a really nice flint. Have you got the flint? Yeah. Let's, uh, let's have a quick look at that. A bunch of clay pipe everywhere too. Bits of clay pipe. See that? So that. Um, for those who don't know, that's uh, flint from a flintlock musket. Uh, black in colour, so probably uh, come over from England. Yeah. The uh, Suffolk flint was uh, was very dark like that. I've got a flintlock rifle, a musket myself, and uh, we still use the same, and it's shaped exactly the same. Yeah. But uh, that was just a surface find, so that's a really nice find. So all this stuff uh, indicates a nice early sight. So um, we're really going to hammer this area now, oh, yeah. and uh, we're, we're pretty pumped. <laughs> we 
Ryan's got another really good signal here. I uh, just dug it. Oh, we got, mate. I don't know, it's either a really early coin or a flat button. It's, I just gotta give it a couple of sprees here. I think it might be a coin. Uh, I don't really see a shank mark on it. Yeah, it's a coin. It's a coin. It's, uh, you can't get nothing off of it, it's pretty flat. I'll clean it up. And yeah, alright. Yeah, sweet, man. Good. Not that deep, really? No, a couple inches. Great. Oh, nice one, man. Nice. Cool. It's got a cracking little find. Uh, we've been doing really well today, but I've got a little silver. Let me uh, let me show you this one. Oh, I'm so happy. Uh, there we go. It's a little, little American three cent piece, 1852. Uh, with the AT Pro come up, um, I think mid 60s. Uh, awesome little find you know I haven't had a good coin for so long uh, my first silver of the year in fact so pleased I'll show you Ryan uh, we've been really well on this site we've been uh, pulling out buttons musket balls uh, Ryan got a, a nice arrowhead uh, we've pulled a couple of flints from the surface I've got a nice one that I found a little while ago so uh, yeah we're delighted this has turned out to be a really good hunt Another killer one, yeah, what we got? Big coin here, I haven't cleaned it off yet. Just quite, quite deep down actually. Give it a spray. Uh, I think this one's gonna be early, early 1800s. Uh, what do we got here? He's a you had a really nice signal on that, didn't you? Yeah, it was, it was 90s. Great. Oh, great. Uh, what do we got? George on there. Oh, George. Yeah. Second or third? <laughs> You've got me. <laughs> um, uh, I don't know. I don't know what that is. All right, well, yeah, let's we'll clean up a little bit more and we'll, we'll uh, done for the uh, day now. In fact, there was two hunts there, so um, the other, the bits we found yesterday, we've already taken home, but we'll, uh, I'll put a couple of photos of those in now. What did you get yesterday? You got that artillery one? Yeah, I got the artillery. Yeah, that was, that was awesome. Actually, 15 musket balls yesterday. Yeah, I've got like maybe four musket balls yesterday, not much else, a buckle, that's about it. That's we had a better day today, so I'll show you what we had today. What we got today, this is Ryan's stuff on the right-hand side. Oh, look at that, mate. That's nice. That's a real freaking nice spot. Look at that. So you think that one's a uh, spear point? Yeah, and it will pretty much anything bigger than an inch is a spear point. That's awesome. Look at that. You've had one of those every time we've been out lately. <laughs> I wish it wasn't broken on the back. Uh, uh, yeah, a little bit, a little bit off the end here. That's that was a nice spot, bro. A little uh, musket flint. Yeah. Great. Uh, all these bits of clay pipe, look at them, everywhere. All right, so what we got here? That's just a flat worn out coin. All right, so you're gonna clean that up. Yep. Um, again with this, uh, we think Bank of Montreal token, yep. 1817 maybe? Yeah. Something along there. 1837, one of the two. <laughs> All right, again, if you clean that one up, yep. guys, what you can do if you wanna see these cleaned up, uh, check out our Facebook page, that's Relic Rescue crew at, on Facebook and um, Ryan's Relic Rescue uh, or Ryan's Facebook page is Ryan Relic Rescue and mine is Kev Relic Rescue uh, so check those out and we'll see decent photos of those cleaned up now, this one is a good one from today yep. I'm trying to get the focus right okay I think we've got it um, a little military button it's kind of needs a good clean but we believe that's a four on there so once again, Ryan's going to um, give that one a good clean up in a couple of days. Hopefully it's going to uh, start telling us a little bit more. So I'm sure he's going to do some research and he'll tell us on Facebook what that one is. But that's a cracking find, mate. Yeah, good a, job. It's weird how it has that uh, shank is pewter too. Let's have a look at the back. Yeah, shank's still on there. It's awesome. That's a good find. Yeah, like I always like the military ones out here. All right, so you got... Uh, a bunch of little musket balls and uh, lead. Yeah. 
cool. And lost focus again. There we go. And all right, this this was interesting. So you got two of these little flat buttons. I think we got got you digging those on one of the videos, and then just further along, I got one exactly the same, and they're all pretty much identical. They seem to be plain, but they've got um, like a gilding on. Come up in nice condition. I think they'll clean up pretty nice. Uh, so yeah, three of those out the same field. That's that's interesting. Right, my stuff for for the day. Um, got a few bits and pieces, musket balls, and uh, some camp lead. Little tiny furniture rivet. We believe probably not very old. Uh, I was very happy to find this today. I got a little uh, flint from a musket or uh, an old flintlock rifle or something. Smaller than a brown best flint. But kind of cool, I'm really happy with that. A uh, couple of fossils here. I always pick up the fossils. The boys like those at home. So this, uh, I don't know how it's going to come out. Let me move it out of the sunshine. Here we go. So that is, uh, we believe, a thimble. Silver. Very flattened. That's nice. Pretty crudely marked there. So it's an early one. See some, uh, Somebody's stamped, stamped that decoration. Some little triangles in the bottom with some circles further up. Both sides and then joined there. That's really cool. And then um, little little American US three cent here. I'm trying to get a decent shot of this. All right, well I'll take I'll take a photo anyway. Let me. Oh, I've lost it for a second. Where is it? Oh, there it is. I think uh, 1852 that one. I was well overdue a coin. I haven't had one for such a long time. So uh, very happy with that. I'll show you the uh, other side. Yeah, so cool. And this thing, I had to lug this around all day as well, so that was awesome. Didn't find much in the way of uh, uh, iron out there. There was lots in the ground, but nails and stuff, nothing decent, no horseshoes or anything. Well, there we go, mate. Another successful hunt, a lot of fun. Yeah, good day. Yeah, it was an enjoyable one. All right, so... There we go, that's our two hunts for the last couple of days. We hopefully we'll get out again next week for another video. So in the meantime, check us out on Facebook. That's Relic Rescue Crew on Facebook. And we'll put better photos of our finds on there. And uh, please subscribe to our channel if you enjoyed it. And look out for our next video. Cheers, bye.